Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. Today we will try something new. I have here a monocular telescope from Amazon. You could use it handhold and you can use it with your mobile phone. What I will do now is to test it with my iPhone. I will shoot some images and then I will place my iPhone on this monocular telescope and after that we will compare these two images. But now let's see what we have here in the box. First we have here a hand strap, what comes now, we have here a tripod, it's full of plastic, but it looks very solid, it feels quite good, yes, Let's place it here. Okay, this is the mobile phone holder, there you can adjust it, okay, good, okay, let's, let's take this little bad boy out here. Yeah. Wow, it looks very good. It's quite heavy. It's, wow, it looks that it's very good coding there. Okay, I'm impressed about this quality. It looks very solid. There you can adjust the focus. Okay, nice. Okay, let's try it out with my mobile phone. Let's see if we have any improvement with it. Good, see you later. Okay, back again. As you could see, I've mounted my mobile phone and I found it very weird because you see here, only like a hole or something and I have adjusted it a lot of time but I can't do it better or I, I didn't find a way to do it better. The only thing what I can do is to press on this but there you see the focus is pumping and it's not so good. I've tried, tried to zoom a little bit more, maybe this works, I will try to take a picture, okay, let's go, In video mode, the same. Try to zoom in a little bit. Try to film. Okay, now I will try to capture these images with my mobile phone and then we will compare these two images. Okay, this is the picture that we have taken with the monocular telescope and on the first look it looks very clear. A uh, lot of details, but it gets very soft here on the edges. Now we will go to the picture that we get if we are zooming in a little bit. Okay, this looks quite good. Yeah, you see a lot of details. Okay. Just to show you the distance that we have, I was standing here and this is what we 
are trying to capture. And I think it's a very good result. Now we will switch to the photo that I have taken with the iPhone on the tele lens. And you see it's completely washed out. If we are zooming in. Wow, it's look at this. The iPhone is struggling to capture all the details here. This is the Taylor lens and this is a wide lens when I'm zooming in. And here the same result. Completely washed out. It looks good, but if we are zooming in No way. Now we will put these images side by side. This is what you see here if we compare the, the photo with, that I've taken with the monocular telescope. And here is what I have taken with the telephoto lens of the iPhone. Let's zoom in. Yeah. Look at these trees here. You have problem to notice it on the iPhone. Yeah, I think it works. Yes, it looks quite good. You have definitely improvement here if you are using monocular telescope instead of your telephoto lens. In the end of this video, I will show you again the video footage that I've taken with the iPhone and on the monocular telescope and you can decide for yourself if it's good or not. So if you like this test, I would appreciate if you could leave a like and subscribe to my channel. And if you have any questions about this, please write in the comments. I will try to answer them all. See you next time.